Hi everyone, welcome to JavaScript coding interview series and in today's video you have to find the out map output for the below code and you have to provide a valid reason why you have selected that particular answer as your option. The question is you have a const map data and where you are creating a new map object, okay, it's creating a new map object and it, in this map data you are uh, setting the key uh, name and the value is test and similarly you are setting another key okay map data uh, dot set subject in javascript and now we are going to print three values one is console dot log of map data dot has has actually will uh, check where it's a boolean it will indicate whether an element with the specified key exists in that particular map or not okay so map data dot has of key name uh, similarly map data dot has of uh, key subject and we will be actually printing the size so in the map we will be having how many key value pairs are uh, available so that will be uh, the number of elements in the map will be decided by the size so we are uh, printing that and there are four options the first one is true true and two the size is two similarly we have a false true and size is one and similarly we have true false and size one similarly false false and size zero so please try from your end and see what is the output you are getting so let's try from our end and see what is the output we are getting. I have this particular script in test.js and for the moment I am just uh, commenting this uh, console. Okay. And uh, this particular script I am calling in the index.html as you can see here. I am passing the script over here. So let me run this particular uh, index.html and see if everything is running fine or fine. Okay. I have this running and for the moment I will just uh, open the console and make everything ready. Okay, so now the console is open and it's up and running. So now uh, what we will do, we have to understand what is map. Okay, before we deep dive into the uh, solution part, we have to know what is a map. So the map object, it actually holds key value pairs. Okay, it also, it holds key value pairs and it remembers the original insertion. There is a, a key uh, order, okay, how the keys are actually inserted and any value like it can be the key can be uh, any object or primitive values okay maybe either used as a key or a value okay it can be either object or a primitive value whatever it can be so a map object is basically holding a key value pair and it remembers the order in which it is inserted and the value can be either an object or a primitive values okay and the main thing is that the key should be uh, occurring only once and it is a unique in the maps collection the key has to be unique and so map is actually similar to object uh, because both will be able uh, setting uh, the key uh, values you will be able to retrieve those values using the keys you can delete the keys and uh, whether it, it can also detect whether something is stored at a key okay but the main difference is a map does not contain any keys by default we have to set that key okay it, it will not be but it will be an empty object empty map okay and in that we have to uh, set the keys but an object is on the other hand is having a prototype so it contains default keys and a map key can be any value as we have already mentioned it can be functions it can be objects or any other primitive value but the key of an object should be either a string or a simple okay so these are some of the uh, differences and also uh, we can also use the size property the map is having a size property so in our question we will be dealing with this where we will be able to see how many uh, items or elements are there in that particular map but for getting the object the number of items in an object we have to uh, do a manual uh, we have to determine that manually so these are some of the uh, differences between object and there are many other differences as well so that you can more explore more on that so coming to our question so uh, what we are trying to do we are trying to uh, set key uh, to the uh, map data that we have created we are trying to create a new map uh, map of map data so we are uh, cre created a map map data in that we have to set uh, two keys one is name and one is subject okay so how we will actually deal with it so first we will uh, try to print uh, once we set this map data of name equal to test then we can print uh, console.log of map data okay so we can actually print that so what you can see here is we have set this particular name okay name as here and uh, we, are, we are providing test so if you print this console.log of map data then you can see 
okay you can see uh, it has name key and the test is uh, but as you can see here the size is zero and it is also returning map of zero all right why it is doing that so all the map operators okay if we are setting this particular way of uh, setting this key it is actually failing so how this uh, map will be set so what we have done for the name right so this way of setting a property does not interact with the map data structure okay we we will be able to see that in the console but it is actually you can see here the size is still zero because uh, the way we have actually set that uh, for like for a project object we have done that but this will not work with map because it will not interact with the map data structure and it uses the feature of generic object and the value is to not stored in the map for queries and all the other operations like uh, map dot size map dot has all those will be fa failing so what is the correct usage of storing data in the map uh, so it is through the set key value method so that is why so this console dot log of map data will fail and map data will uh, pass but the, it will not be actually interacting with the map data structure and hence this particular console okay in the question what just i am uncommenting that so what will happen if it is actually this is actually a property that is available within the map and hence it will fail because it, the way we have actually set the particular key for the map data is through this uh, particular uh, attribute setting like map data of name so this is not the proper way of setting the name and hence it will fail so we can see that in the console it will throw false okay so that is false now okay so that is uh, the first case okay the setting is uh, not uh, according to the map data structure okay now in the second case what we did map data dot set of uh, subject and uh, uh, javascript so if we uh, hover over set, uh, set what it means it adds a new element with a specified key and value to the map so if an element with the same key already exists the element will be updated okay so map data dot set of subject and javascript so this will actually uh, pass now if i do the console so this is according to the map data structure and now if i do the console you can see here that the map size will be updated to one okay so here you can see map of one and it is having an entries uh, array in that the first entry is zero is subject and the value is javascript and similarly you have this name test which we have set earlier but this is not part of the map data structure and hence the size is actually one okay so now you can uh, guess the answer right so if i just uncomment this particular uh, second uh, question okay map data dot has so this will actually work because it is according to the map data structure the correct way of storing the data and hence this is true now you can also guess the size of map data right so the first one uh, does not come under map data structure so this will actually uh, not be part of the map data size and hence the size would be what would be one right so it will not be two so this is the way so that's about the map uh, how the value has to be set in a map so this is the proper way so as you can see here the correct usage of storing data in the map is through the set key value method okay so the other one will not be according to the map data structure and it will fail all the map operations will fail on this case and hence the correct answer is uh, false true and one option b is the right answer so just a recap of what map is map will be actually holding key value pairs it is uh, similar to object but there are some differences like uh, uh, it, the key value will be uh, any value for a map okay it can be functions objects but for an object it should be string and uh, there is a size property where you can actually find the number of elements in a map which is not available in object and it uh, map does not have any key by default but object is having a prototype so it does uh, contain a uh, default keys so that's it for uh, today's video uh, thanks a lot for watching